Are you going to heaven should you die? Are you going to spend time with God and your past on loved ones? Do you know? Do you know whether you're going to heaven or hell? Do you know Jesus Christ? Is he your Lord and Savior? You know, the Bible says in Romans 3 verse 23 that all men have sinned and have fell short of the glory of God. Meaning that everybody, every human being that is in this world are subject to the fallen nature of sin and the judgment which is death. Because simply Adam and Eve fell in the garden when they disobeyed God. And because we all come from him, therefore we became subjected to the same punishment. But that doesn't have to be like that for you. If you accept Jesus Christ, make him your Lord and Savior, become born again, you will go to heaven and not go to hell. Hell was made for Satan and his demons. All of them have been judged since they fell from heaven and disobeyed God. They've been judged to go to burn forever in hell. And that is not your place. I want to talk to you where you are. I want you to make a decision today, at this moment, to receive the Lord Jesus Christ, to receive him and make him your personal Lord and Savior. There's a prayer I want to pray with you. Would you pray this prayer with me? It's very simple and it's very short because the Bible says that if you confess with your mouth that Jesus Christ is Lord and believe in your heart that he died on the cross and rose from death, you will be saved. Let's pray this prayer. Say, Heavenly Father, I come to you just as I am. Lord, I give you my life, knowing that I was born a sinner. I accept and hence come forth to you to receive eternal life. You said in your word that if we accept you as our Lord and Savior, we will be saved and we will have an eternal life. I surrender my past. I give you my present. I give you my future. Lord Jesus, you are my master and savior. In Jesus' name, amen. If you've prayed this prayer, you are now born again. And I say, welcome to the kingdom of God. May you follow the instructions, the commandments, which are found in the Bible that God instructs all his children to follow. Follow me, subscribe, because I'm all about preaching the gospel and helping children of God live right, live according to what God wants and requires of us. And share this with someone. Share this with someone that the Holy Spirit brings to your heart right now. And thank you. God bless you.